In this video, we will introduce the first step to building a Simavance model, that is, generating entities. The Simavance library can be accessed from the Simulink library browser. It contains the blocks that you would need to model a discrete event-based system. The customers of the restaurant can be modeled as entities in Simavance. Entities are discrete items of interest, typically waiting to use some resource. To introduce entities into the model, we use blocks from the Entities Generator sublibrary, which can be found under the Generators tab. For this case, we will use the Time-Based Entity Generator. This block Let's us specify the time between the creation of two consecutive entities or the intergeneration time in its block parameters. We can choose from three built-in distributions, constant, uniform, or exponential. To model customers entering the restaurant at different time instances, let's use a uniform distribution with a minimum of zero and a maximum of 20. To view these entities, we can use an instantaneous entity counting scope. This block can be found under the Simavance Sync Library. I'll increase the simulation time to 200. Running the model, we observe entities being created at different time instances. These time units could represent any unit of time that you are modeling, such as seconds, minutes, hours, or years. In this video, we learned how to introduce entities into a Simovance model.